Hello, I'm going to show you how to use the file upload step. Now, best best way to learn is an example, and I've got the basic version of Gmail open here because that's really easy to interact with, and I'm going to show you how to use the upload step by uploading a file to a, a Gmail. Okay, I'm going to open Axiom. I've got an Axiom I've already built with Blue Petering it here. If you may not know what Blue Peter is, it was a child's program. It, it, it showed you how to do things, but it always show you in stages and have the model kind of pre-built as you went along. Okay, anyway, enough chit-chat. So, the first part of the bot, the first interact step, is basically go to a page, download a file. Now, the second part, the second interact step, goes to the Gmail. You'll click Compose. You'll enter um, an email address, subject, body, and click send but I also want to send an attachment so I need to add a sub step that's because the upload and download files are sub steps that's an important thing to remember because you'll only find them within the interact step which does all the browser automation in Axiom okay so you won't find it in add step you'll find it in add a sub step second thing that you probably would already figured out by now you need the desktop app if you haven't got it installed, you will see a message telling you to install it. Simply follow the prompts. There is a version for Linux, PC, and Mac. I'll also put the link in um, the comments, and it will also be on our website. So, Okay, let's add the step. We're going to add it after the body. I'm just going to search for download. And we've got two versions, download multiple or down... Oh, sorry, we're doing upload here. Upload single or multiple so i'm just going to upload a file and first thing you do is of course select the element on the page that you want to upload the file to then insert your file path so that you can literally type in if you don't ever remember your path you can click select and just simply select the file from your desktop or I'm just going to click cancel or the really smart thing about Axiom is that you can pass data from steps from the other steps so I can pass the name from the download file because it's in this interact step straight into the upload file which is really handy or I could pass it from a Google Sheet an API, Zapier connection, Integromat all those cool um, API automation tools. And I can just do it by passing the token in there. It'll take the um, name of the file and it will um, upload the file when I click run. Pretty cool. Um, happily demonstrate it if you keep watching. Here we go. Here we go, the desktop app's opened up. I'm just gonna drag it in. Let's have a sip of my drink as well. Now, it's just doing the download bit first before the upload. And we should also see the bot fill in email address. That is my email address. Please get in touch if you need some help. Now it's just going to attach the file. There you go, the file's being attached. Let's see upload step for you. Thank you.